live streaming test with the new Sony ZV E10 camera using Restream. And I'm running this through Minicam. I've got a green screen behind me. Let's flick on the green screen. This is this Donald Trump's living room? It's another bad European background. But it looks pretty good. It's picking up the color. The maximum resolution you could get out of this is 720. It's HD. It's like plenty resolution for streaming in most cases. I won't go any higher than 720. And my voice should be coming through this microphone. I do have the fuzzy kitten on it. Actually, let me double check that, make sure that is working. Yep, that is. Hello, 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 hello. It's a little bit echoey, but it is what it is. Let's go ahead and turn this off. Bring the green screen down. We're neighbors. We got the background blur going on. I can turn that off and clear the background. Let me check that. Yeah, that's that here. So that is clear, I think. And then we can fuzz the background a little bit. It's kind of dark in here. And I'm wearing some weird stuff. So I think it looks pretty good. The streaming test looks successful. I think we are going to be okay. This is connected with a USB cable directly to the computer's USB-C. Now that's the difference here. It's USB-C to USB-C. And it is charging when I do USB-C to USB-C. When I do USB-C to USB-C, uh, USB-A, it does not charge. It will pass through, but it will not charge. But right now, this guy is charging the battery. So it's not using the battery in the camera. It's actually using the computer's USB-C power. So that is pretty cool. It's looking good.